Hey, I'm Naomi and I make weird faces out of clay. Now, I don't know what my art style is called. Some call it beautiful, some call it weird, but I call it trying to make it look like something a professional did, but instead it came out looking like something I did. But don't worry, that's a compliment. I, I, I think. Anyway, I started making things out of clay last April, which is pretty crazy to me because now, fast forward eight months, I have over a million followers on TikTok and my own business. So it just comes to show that if you want to try something new, go for it because you never know. It might change your life. Now, I hate to say this because I want to be a perfect artist, but I'm actually really bad at coming up with new ideas for my art. Like, who has that kind of creative imagination? Not I. I literally wait, wait, and wait for a new idea to pop up in my head. And after a few long seconds of waiting, I'm still exactly where I was before. A complete mess without an idea. The hardest part about starting my business is actually starting it. It is so scary at first, like who's gonna buy it? Am I gonna look stupid while I raise my money? But just don't stress about it and start it. And I know, easier said than done, but everything in life is scary at first. So don't let being scared stop you from being successful. Remember, stay positive, stay productive, and stay smart and you'll make it. What is the meaning behind my art? Well, to tell you the truth, I honestly don't know. I want to be the artist who's like, I capture my emotions, my soul, and my spirit into my pieces. But me, I'm just here like, um, I like arts and crafts. But I have to say the best feeling about being an artist is when someone buys something, which is kind of obvious, but not because I'm getting money to feed into my shopping habits, but because it tells me that someone actually thinks that spending the money that they worked hard for is worth an art piece of mine, which makes me feel like Picasso if I do say so myself. <laughs> 